getting more excited for season two every day now and after watching this I'm getting even more excited. <laughs> Invincible Adam Eve is an is the new special is the first special episode in the Invisible T Invincible TV show and it's directed by Haley Herrick and in this special prequel episode Samantha Adam Eve Wilkins discovers her superpowers as a young girl and must come to terms with her own sinister origins as she discovers a family she never knew she had. Hello, you weird, beautiful movie lovers. My name is Louie, a gay movie fandom, and today we're talking about the new episode from Invincible. Now, I watched the first season for Invincible this year back in February, and oh my god, did I love it. And I was just punching myself in the face for not watching this when it came out. And, and when... The trailer for season two recently dropped. I got so excited, especially when the date was revealed, November 3rd. And I will be reviewing that when it comes out, just to say. And also, surprisingly, they put on a trailer. They release a trailer for a special episode that's a prequel focused on Adam Eve, one of the characters from Invincible, as you may know. Um... And honestly, I was surprised, and I really wanted to know when is this coming out, and then I realized, wait, it's today? I, I, but then I just didn't watch it, now I finally have watched it a couple days later, and now I'm gonna give you my thoughts, spoiler free. Okay, so, starting off with the positive here, um, the animation, obviously, just like the TV show, is amazing. It has, it fits its comic style. It's amazing, especially with the action sequences. Oh my god, even though there is basically just one humongous action scene in this, it looks gorgeous. It's absolutely amazing. Also, the story itself is also great. It's interesting, fascinating. It's um it's unpredictable and honestly I loved it. Um the voice acting is great obviously of course from Invincible. I mean from the show we we do have JK Simmons in it uh, who is briefly in it mostly uh, at the beginning and then a little post credit scene. <laughs> And, and the voice acting here is great. And also I will say, um, Adam Eve herself, she gets a lot more development here. And watching this, it makes me care about her more than I already did in the first season. Um, also the characters, once again, are great. I really liked them. Um, the only issue I will say I had is that I would have liked a little more from her backstory, because, like, we don't fully get a lot more. I feel like this could have been five minutes long. This is basically, like, 55 minutes. So, it's a 55-minute episode, uh, which is uh, normal for uh, Invincible's runtime for episodes. But I think this could have been an hour longer. As in, like, just 60 minutes, because I feel like it. Because uh, I did want to know a little more, and it did kind of get unanswered. Uh, that's I'm, I'm just going to say that right now. Um, I don't really have amazing... I don't have a lot of things to say, because um, this is basically just an episode on its own. But honestly, I had a blast with this episode, and honestly, I'm going to give Invincible Adam Eve an A. Yeah, definitely one of my favorite episodes from Invincible. Definitely not my favorite, but it's still really great. So, what are your thoughts on this episode from Invincible? Did you love it? Hate it? Let's agree, disagree down below in the comments. Come on, tell me. And uh, I'm just going to leave it there. Uh, what are your uh, anticipation levels for uh, Season 2 of Invincible? Uh, also, my review for Talk to Me will come Saturday, since I'm seeing that tomorrow night. So, yeah. Um, anyways, that's it. Stay awesome.